Welcome to the Daily Reminder Network. The Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam informed us in a hadith. He said, "Ahabu al-amal ila Allah adwamuha wa in qal." The most beloved deeds in the sight of Allah is that which is most consistent even if it is a small amount this hadith is a very powerful hadith to help us be firm and strong and be upright and that's in this in being upright and being consistent in doing good deed is so important that a companion came to the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and he said to him he said o messenger of allah tell me something in islam that no one else can advise me about meaning tell me something important that only you would be able to give so this is a very important advice and it's an advice that if put to practice will benefit us in this life and the hereafter and you know the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam was given what was called jawami al kalam jawami al kalam meaning he was given the the eloquence of precise and concise speech meaning concise and precise but with vast meaning and vast benefits few words yet these words are words that should be written with gold because they are so beneficial in way where you if you were to reflect upon them and so the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said to this companion he said qul amantu billah thumma istaqim say i believe in allah and then have al istiqama al istiqama is being upright and consistently upright but we know that our iman goes up and down and the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam mentioned it also he said inna li kulli amalin shirra indeed every deed that we do has its high points and there are times in which we're motivated like you have a lot of energy full of energy to do some of these deeds wa inna li kulli shirratin fatra but every single point of motivation that you have that zeal that you may have also has a down point a low point where it actually it doesn't stay that mo- your motivation doesn't stay that way and it goes back down and he said who's ever who's ever's low point still within my sunnah meaning you don't crash you go down but there's a limit and if you don't crash and and every and a low point fatra means just a low point you know like a, a downtime and who's ever downtime and low point is still within the sunnah then he will be successful then he will be successful and so that's why it's very important for us to be consistent in our deeds but how can we be consistent consistency is the key even if it's a small amount if we're consistent with our deeds And how can we be consistent with our deeds? You have we have to understand that when we make a commitment, do not commit yourself to something you're not going to be able to be consistent with. Try to set a minimum requirement that you will do for the rest of your life. That you can do every day, even on the busiest day in your life. Consistency in recitation of the Quran, in giving sadaqah consistency in visiting the sick consistency in fasting in charity and in everything that we do well the the key is what the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said ahabbul a'mal ila allah adwamuha wa in qal the most beloved deeds in the sight of allah are that which is most consistent even if it is just a small amount donate now Go to the dailyreminder.org slash donate.